A moonlight tower or moon tower is a lighting structure designed to illuminate areas of a town or city at night. The towers were popular in the late 19th century in cities across the United States and Europe, they were most common in the 1880s and 1890s. In some places they were used when standard street lighting, using smaller, shorter, and more numerous lamps, was impractically expensive. In other places they were used in addition to gas street lighting. The towers were designed to illuminate areas often of several blocks at once, on the high light principle. Arc lamps, known for their exceptionally bright and harsh light, were the most common method of illumination. As incandescent electric street lighting became common, the prevalence of towers began to wane. Topic. Austin, Texas Austin, Texas, is the only city in the world known to still have moonlight towers. They are 165 feet 50 meters tall with foundations 15 feet 4 .6 meters wide. The towers were manufactured in Indiana by Fort Wayne Electric Company and assembled on site. In 1894, the city of Austin purchased 31 used towers from Detroit. A single tower cast light from six carbon arc lamps, illuminating a 1,500 feet 460 meters radius circle brightly enough to read a watch. In 1993, the city of Austin dismantled the towers and restored every bolt, turnbuckle and guy wire as part of a $1.3 million project, the completion of which was celebrated in 1995 with a citywide festival. Detroit Detroit, Michigan had a particularly extensive system of light towers inaugurated in 1882 with 122 towers, 175 feet 53 meters tall and 1,000 to 1,200 feet 300 to 370 meters apart downtown, shorter, less powerful, and twice as far apart elsewhere. The towers were masts secured with cables and were maintained daily by crew who hauled themselves to the top using a counterweighted elevator. The system covered about 21 square miles 54 square kilometers, but soon had to be supplemented with incandescent lighting in the city center, partly because trees interfered with the light, and by the turn of the century they remained only in Cadillac Square. The towers were soon removed there, too. New Orleans Towers were erected in New Orleans, Louisiana, starting in the early 1880s. One set of towers illuminated a section of the Mississippi River levee, aiding in loading and unloading ships at night in the busy port. A tower at the busy intersection of Canal Street, Bourbon Street, and Carondelet Street was constructed with a set of four water pipes to aid in fire fighting in the nearby multi-story buildings. Topic. San Jose, California In 1881, a 237-foot tall tower was erected spanning the intersection of Santa Clara and Market Streets in San Jose, California, making it the first city to be illuminated by electric light west of the Rocky Mountains. James Jerome J. J. Owens, publisher of the San Jose Mercury, came up with the idea for the tower after visiting the first electrical lighting station in San Francisco in 1879. The tower collapsed in a storm on December 3, 1915. In 1977, a nearly half-sized replica, 115 feet 35 meters tall, was constructed at the San Jose Historical Museum. Topic. Wabash, Indiana Wabash, Indiana, was the first city to use arc lamps, four mounted on the City Hall Dome, turned on on March 31, 1880. Wabash used a self-regulating lamp invented by Charles Brush in 1870. 